Hey everybody, it's Jennifer with the Common Milkweed and we're out here looking at our strawberry plants. And they are in full bloom. They look super fabulous. And as I was walking by, I noticed that there's all these insects flitting over the top, which you would expect because these are flowering and they're getting pollinated. But what I didn't really expect was to see how many sweat bees are in here doing the pollinating all these little flying bodies around and I'm trying to get one captured. You might be able to see some of the flitting around, but they are tiny. They're all different kinds of sweat bees. I don't see one honeybee in here. So sweat bees are some of our native bees. And you probably know them because some of the time just come visit your sweat on your arms. They always like to visit me because yes, I sweat a lot. So I think I'm freaking them out with the camera here. Now I do see there's a mining bee down here as well. Okay, I know you could see that one flying around. There we go. Covered in pollen. The legs are just covered in pollen. Super cool. Here we go, here's another kind. There we go, I just flitted in and out. They definitely don't like me blocking the sun. But I just found this really fascinating because here is one of our native pollinators, actually several different species, and they're just doing a great job. We always get a huge strawberry crop and I can see already a bunch coming in down here. So what do we do to get all of these native pollinators here? Well, I think y'all probably have gathered by now. We have planted tons and tons of wildflowers everywhere. And not just wildflowers, but trees, shrubs, they all have really important blooms. And then we work to create the habitat that all of these invertebrates, birds, and plants need. And so, it's working like a charm. Okay, happy strawberry growing.